first anesthetize the patient's eye. To turn on the AccuPen, press and release any of the control buttons. The unit will show a display on the screen and beep twice when ready for use. Quickly press and release the Action button. The AccuPen will beep twice and display a rotating line indicating that it is ready for measurements. Gently tap the transducer tip on the patient's cornea. The probe should be perpendicular to the apex of the cornea and measurements should be taken at the center of the cornea. When the unit is being properly applied to the cornea, the unit will produce short chirps followed by one longer chirp. The longer chirp indicates you have obtained an IOP measurement. The number of short chirps can vary, but typically three to five chirps will produce one measurement. To obtain a second IOP measurement, position the pen into testing position. Press and release the action button and tap the cornea again. You can record up to nine separate IOP readings and can view the independent readings by using the arrow buttons next to the LCD screen to scroll through the measurements. To view the acquired measurements, use the arrow keys. When multiple measurements have been captured, an asterisk next to one of the numbers will indicate the furthest from the average. To delete individual measurements, hold down one of the arrow buttons for approximately three seconds. The unit will chirp, indicating the measurement on the screen has been deleted. After deleting one measurement, the AccuPen will automatically update the average IOP measurement. The AccuPen also has an IOP adjustment calculator. Hold down the Action button for three seconds to enter the IOP adjustment mode. Enter the patient's central corneal thickness by using the arrow buttons to scroll up or down. Press and hold to increase or decrease thickness by increments of 10. It is important to note the AccuPen does not take corneal thickness measurements. To clear the AccuPen completely, hold down both arrow buttons for approximately 3 seconds. The unit will chirp, indicating the measurements have been deleted. Once six zeros appear on the screen, the unit is ready to acquire a new measurement.